Welcome to a video from the digitallifestyle.com. In this video, we're going to have a look at the new build Windows 10 for Windows Insiders. This is 14279. And uh, a few minor changes to this as Microsoft continue with the Redstone releases. So, the first thing we'll see change on this is the new lock screen. Notice when I slide up on this, it stays on there. And then we get the sign in screen up using that existing background, a bit like it does on Windows Phone. So what you're seeing there is, is exactly what you get on Windows Phone where you've got the combined lock screen. So this is all part of the, the new lock screen. Okay, what else is new in this build? Not a huge amount, but we have got Cortana can do reminders now. So I just typed it to Cortana, remind me to get milk, and then it's brought up that reminder there. So I've got a, a get milk reminder in Cortana, and I can change that if I want, and I can add things like uh, the person and uh, the time and that kind of thing as well. So I could do it you know, next time I go to the supermarket, remind me to get milk. So that's new for there. And in fact, my uh, phone is trying to do that at the same time, uh, hearing me saying uh, Cortana. So that's a new thing. You've got reminders in Cortana. And all your reminders go together. Here's when I've been testing. And, uh, and here's that milk one on there. Uh, the now enabled Cortana for Spanish, Mexico, Portuguese, Brazil and French Canadian languages. Um, so if you're inside it, you can now use Cortana in that, which is really good. There's quite a few fixes in this build as well. They've uh, fixed Microsoft Edge and Cortana crashed. Uh, when using roaming profiles, they fixed an, an issue with Cortana that would show reminders that are completed. I've seen that. I've got quite a few reminders that seem to be completed. They fixed issues where item copied moved up to the desktop would not display until you refresh the desktop. And um, they fixed an issue where certain driver downloads from Windows update, update was actually causing the PC to blue screen, which is not something that you want. There are some issues with this, they're investigating issues with Surface Pro 3, Surface Pro 4 and the Surface Book devices where they experience freezing or hanging um, and the trackpad don't work and you have to do a power reset to enable that. So again, warning you that going on the fast ring will mean you get bugs in your, in your builds. Uh, there's still issues with hibernation, so if, um, you might be getting blue screens or uh, or just a, fr a freeze when you're coming out of hibernation, so just be aware of that. It doesn't affect sleep, but it does affect hibernation. There's some issues with web uh, wireless encryption protocol connecting to older networks as well. So there are a few issues, but you can follow the link on the digitallifestyle.com with the full list of, um, of changes on that. So overall, a few incremental improvements. The reminder, which is pretty good. Uh, so I'll have another go at those on. Remind me to. There you are, you can see how it comes up like that. So reminders are pretty good, and the new lock screen experience, I think it looks better, it's more consistent with the phone experience. The new lock, lock screen experience, I think, is better. It's more consistent with the way it was in the way it is in the, in the phone. You've just got one lock screen. In fact, we better just quickly dive into the settings on this. So we've just got that one lock screen option on there now. Uh, so you don't have, um, you may remember you, on the, you had the, the Windows image on the lock screen when you were uh, typing your password in. That's gone now, and it now it just all uses that one. So that's uh, this. So that's build 1.4. 279 of Windows 10 for Windows Insiders on the Fast Ring. More videos on our YouTube channel on the Digital Lifestyle.com. You can go right back to the earliest builds of Windows 10 technical preview. And we'll be back with more videos where Microsoft released new builds. Thanks for watching.